This week on Couple Up. You talking? You go for it. <laughs> I slid in her DM. Slide in the DM. She liked me at that point in time, basically. So he says. Uh, Everybody know he's a lyrics band. Um. Basically. You want to appear to forward now, to, to tears. It was love at first sight. I'm a woman who knows what I want. As I see this girl, I get real nervous. Just seeing him smile. Wow. Honestly, she's my best friend. In order to make a relationship work, you need to compromise. Without trust, there can be no relationship. If there's one thing, I really love children. It was the way he looked at me, it made me blush. I'm ready to spend the rest of my life with him. So basically, I'm on Facebook. Um, I'm pretty big on Facebook, I must say. Yeah. So I had a, I think a while actually, a few months, probably a year, something like that. So she would post things, I would post things, she might comment on it, she might like the stuff, or you know, that kind of vibes. So I think she had posted something a day. She was angry about something. So you know. Any kind of guy that I, was, <laughs> I was pretty concerned about a young lady, her well-being and her welfare. So you know, I I was in her DMs. I, sl I slid in her DMs. Slide in the DMs. Yeah, you know. So we had a we had a brief convo. You know, no want to appear too forward now, too too terse. You know, <laughs> They're too thirsty as you say in China. So you know, we talk, we talk, we talk. Next day we talk some more. Talk some more. Talk some more. And I think eventually we talked for months. Yeah, we talked for yeah a good while. The convo kept repeating itself. You know, she liked me at that point in time, basically. So he says. Um. Yeah. Yeah. And you know, you know, let's keep on talking, talking. You know. So I think a day, um, I was yeah. hungry, right. and you know, I was wondering if she was hungry as well. So I just you know. I had a suggestion for her. Huh? I suggested we go to have a meal together. I mean, I can't see the long lady be hungry and not, you know, offer some some aid, you know. So we, <laughs> <laughs> so we went out. The first time we went out, and yeah, that was that was basically it. Yeah, yeah actually, we good. met for the first time. We were talking a lot WhatsApp, mm -hmm. Facebook, um, yes. and we met for the first time at his birthday party. Oh yes. Actually, so we yes. were talking all the time, ah. yes, yes, um, yes. but should. we officially met each other yeah, at his birthday party. party. And that's a gift too. Like, really? <laughs> <laughs> and, that's a and a letter. So is this all the information is true? Yes, facts, true and only, correct only facts, to only the facts. best of my knowledge. <laughs> only facts I did with Kiva. <laughs> come on, come on. <laughs> come on. <laughs> he was very, very open. Um, and I appreciated that. Um, there wasn't anything to hide, nothing, um, no gray areas. Mm -hmm. He said how he felt, and I appreciated that. What you see is what you get. There's no Reynard at home and Reynard, you know, in the open. This is, this is him, and I really, really appreciated that. Plus, everybody know he's a lyrics fan, is it me? So, yeah. Is it me? Don't feel too bad. Reynard, what about you? What about you? Well, I mean, to be honest, I'm not even going to try to, you know, make it sound too, you know, whatever. I mean, she's a nice girl, she's pretty and thing. And I, I, <laughs> I mark it on the Facebook. I was marking the scene. Yes, he was liking every picture. Ah. Taking and, up the old ones. And then my cousin does have my phone too, so he does kind of be... That's not yeah, true. Yeah, so... That's not true. He know? was all on YouTube yeah. looking for any support. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so she's a nice girl, attractive girl, and, and you know, I mean, let's not lie, I mean, we are men, we are attracted to what we For see. Sure. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, instead of talk more, instead of talk more, instead of talk more. And yeah, I think that was the openness was part of it too. Because yeah. like, you know, gears be fronting out here. They like you, and they try to say that they like you too now. Mm -hmm. So like, you, you could be end up in the friend zone really, really fast. Right. You know, but you know, as is me too, I really don't really know about the friend zone. I haven't been in the friend zone. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm not sure where the friend zone actually is. Right. Um, so yeah, and that was that was what happened. <laughs> Basically, he's laughing, he's laughing. Yeah, and we. I think I think not to sound cliche, but I think we just hit it off. Like, yes. Just off the bat, to the talk, line, hang out. Yeah, she's really she's really nice in terms of 
like the openness too. So we never had no like grey area. Like I wonder if she liked my boy, I wonder if you know, and she she was different because in talking to her in the initial stages, you know, you got like a feedback. So you kinda felt that alright, it was reciprocated. And normally females have a tendency not to want to let the guy know too early if she feeling them because you know you know you have egos and pride and all that. So yeah. I think she didn't really study that with me too much, so she kinda of opened up. I think the only challenge we have really is distance. Mm -hmm. um, he lives in San Fernando, I live in Mayaro. Mm -hmm. So we don't really get to see each other that often with his work schedule and my life. Mm -hmm. um, kind of, I, I think that's the only challenge that we really have distance. Mm -hmm. I, I think so. I mean, she's in the bush today, so <laughs> yeah. she, um, a bit, she's a bit far. But you came to the bush though. <laughs> well, I mean, Hunter's has been in the bush. So. <laughs> When you're, when you're looking for things, you might have to go to the bus sometimes, you know what I mean? So, <laughs> you know what I mean? But we don't really, I think, like I say, we yeah. just, just function real good. Yeah. Um, yeah. But distance being probably the only one, I think, probably for now, that has been kind of hard. Well, you know, like, when I try to like, fit in, Things and I mean, it's something important to you. We really try to make the time for it. So, like, I work shift, I really work like eight or four and come off. So, like, spend plenty of overtime. So, like, in between off days and probably a morning, yeah, yeah it's just like, it's, it's like trying to make it work somehow, yes. I yeah. kind of wish so. We use what, what we used initially, the cell phone. Okay. We yeah. chat. Yeah. For me personally, I would say, like, a big thing is communication. So, over the, what, the year and a month so far, I don't think a day has passed that we didn't, like, talk to each other. Like, Not you know what I mean? Like, even, even if it's for a short period of time, um, communication for me is a big thing because, you know, you have probably some kind of conflict that could be resolved. You could talk about whatever you think important at that time. So, even if you're married for 20 years, even if you're now dating, even if you you know, when they when get married and you engage, I think that couples need to have regular dialogue, regular um, convos. Okay. And then if something not regular, it might kind of get still. Mm -hmm. So you want to keep keep the, 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 the spark or keep the, the energy going, I, I would okay. think, yeah. Okay. One of the things that we um, stated from the jump was reciprocation. So if I could go out of the way for you, then you should feel free to do the same for me. So I think that's one of the things that kept us going and that's what I would advise anybody else to do, reciprocation. 